Good morning, my babies. Let me tell y'all what happened yesterday. I did my video on my box. And guess what? Y'all remember um, this? Mm -hmm. It was still plugged up and it wasn't turned on. So I had no sound on the whole video. Oh. <laughs> but I'm coming back, baby. It ain't going to stop me. I want to show y'all what I used. Look here. Y'all remember I got this um, this uh, shoe polish from the Dollar Tree. Remember that? So I'm just going to show y'all what I did. All right. So I just pushed it like this. My shoe polish. And I rubbed it in. Look at that. Oh, my God. Honey, shoe polish will stain wood. Who would have thunk it? Who would have thunk it, babies? Look here. You just dab it on. Dab it on your wood and rub it in. Look at that. Honey. I would have never known. But it come across my old crazy brain. Hey, let's try that shoe polish on wood. And look at it. It's, I love it. So I just kept going on all sides of the box. Now, baby, this is how you can stain your wood. And you know shoe polish comes. I have black and I don't know if it has the colors on it. Let's see. High and long lasting shine and protects leather. Mm -hmm. No color, of course. But this looks maybe like a white, I guess. And then this one is a brown and a black. Now, I, I remember my daddy shining his shoes. And he had a round little tin thing. And he'd take a rag and rub it on his shoes and, and let it dry and wipe it off. And that was the shiniest doggone shoes I had ever seen in my life. Well, I'm thinking. I was, th I was thinking. Um. Why not use it on wood? See if it works on wood. And look, it does. It's gorgeous. Look, it makes the box look old. Shoe polish, babies. Shoe polish. Okay, now before I show you the front, I'm going to move it over. Now, oh, the next thing I did, I took a little flame Baltic Day and just rubbed my finger like this and put it in there. Look at that. See? Rub you some in there. Look at, oh my god. I think it's so pretty. It just gives it a, a little pop. Look at it. And when it dries, that's it. Okay, now I'm going to set that over there. And I'm going to show you what I use because this video, oh, I couldn't believe it. I went back to play it. Had no sound at all. My mouth was just a getting it, honey, and wasn't nothing coming out. Okay. All right. So I used Baltic Day Flame. I used uh, Baltic Day Dark Sugar, Baltic Day Lime, Baltic Day Iron Dust, Baltic Day Amethyst, which I am out. I had to scrub out of the lid. That's how pigmented it is. And Baltic Day White Stone. Okay, then I used Solar Color Dust, and I used the color blue to purple. Probably can't see it, can you? Because that dog on white. I don't know. But anyway, blue to purple. Solar Color Dust drops. Look at that. Blue to purple. All right, now let me show you this. Oh, my God. Are y'all ready? This is so freaking pretty. Look at this. Now, I took my mica powders and I dusted each one. Flame orange, lime green. That's the purple, the black. And I just dusted that in the um, in the white stone, the cobweb. Oh, my God. Look at it. And look. I love how the shoe polish made the wood look. Look at that. It looks old. 
Ain't that pretty? Oh my God, ain't that pretty? Okay, now let me show you something. So since it's solar color dust, let me cut this light off because I think we got enough light in here. Maybe not. Let me turn this on. Oh, that might be too bright. Oh, my God, that thing came on with a bling, didn't it, baby? Turned down a little bit. All right, now watch this. I'm just going to do one side. And if you take it outside and the sun hits it, it'll change it. It'll change it also. Look at that. It changes from blue to purple. Oh, I had to do this box. I wanted to do it. That was going to be my next project before the painting came. And I got all sidetracked. And y'all know what? I'm still kind of not back in the swing of it for some reason. But anyway, look at that gorgeous purple. Look at that. Honey baby. Honey baby. Ain't that pretty? And then when it gets... Uh, cold it'll go back to blue but anyway there that is that's what i did shoe polish what freaking shoe polish i think that is gorgeous what you think stacy you like it baby i think it's so beautiful oh it's so pretty mm -mm -mm. i'm loving it okay now she uh miss stacy sent me some stuff that she made with her own little sweet hands. And that's what's going to go in here. And some of them are uh, for Halloween. So this will be sitting over there on my table until Halloween next year. Yes, oh yes. And yesterday, I had to, um, took all my stuff off my Halloween table. Oh, it was a sad moment. It was a really a sad moment, guys. And, um... Erased my blessing board, you know. I erase it every month, so I got November right up there now, and um, that kind of gets to me too, you know, erasing it. It really does. But anyway, so now then, let's get the prayers because, of course, you couldn't hear them. Yeah. So how do y'all like it? Do y'all think it's pretty? What do y'all think about that shoe polish? I never would have thought shoe polish. Yeah. So, anyway, let's get the prayers, loves. All right, darling. Continue prayers for Tazzle and Silvercats family. Continue prayers for Debbie Smith's daughter, Rebecca, and Rebecca's friend, Angie, um, that they continue doing good. Uh, Miss Debbie, let me know how they're doing, please, baby. Continue prayers for Miss Frances Carpenter's niece, Carol. Babies, she really, really, really needs a lot of prayers. Um, it's all in God's hands, and uh, if if it's His will, it will be done, right? But it, I always believe it's power in prayer, honey. So let's pray for this baby. Let's pray for Miss Carol, please. Let's pray hard. Oh, Lord Jesus, that the chemotherapy would just set in. And and there's a miracle. Hey, miracles happen every day, don't it? Uh, continued prayers for Stacy Snorf. Her mama has dementia babies. So let's send prayers to Miss Stacy and to um, Stacy's mom. Okay. Continue prayers for Miss Rose. Let's pray that the clot is gone when she goes back to the doctor. Lord, please continue prayers for Becky Parton. She goes back to the doctor in February. And let's pray that uh, she does not have degenerative disease in her eyes. That's a mouthful. And her grandbaby is having a baby. Now, Miss Becky Parton lost her son in 2010. So, She's praying for a little boy. So let's just put a little sp special prayer in there. I know God's already got it planned out, but, you know, it don't hurt to pray for a little boy. All right. Continue prayers for Miss Annette and her mama. Her mama has dementia. Continue prayers for Christine Hutchinson's daughter, baby. Please let that baby get a kidney. She has a seven-year-old son, and she's not a candidate for dialysis. Let's pray that baby gets that kidney. 
Continue prayers for Miss Catherine. Continue prayers for Miss Paulette Jackson for her pain. Continue prayers for Miss Danny McVisions. Continue prayers for TLC's Handmade Hayloft. Um, let me know about your test results, baby, if you got them back, Miss Lisa. Continue prayers for Misty Wilcox family. Continue prayers for Resin Robert. Um, continue prayers for Miss Gypsy Soul 95. Y'all know she was in the hospital with COVID. Well, she's home, and she, but she's on oxygen. So let's continue to pray that she gets better. Let me know, sweet baby, how you doing. Continue prayers for Candace's daughter, Sophia. And her PKS family. PKS is short for Pallister Killian Syndrome. It causes many health issues and global delays, babies. And Miss Candace said it also causes infectious smiles and laughter. Now let's send another prayer to the PKS family. They lost, lost two of their um, angels due to PKS. And let's uh, send prayers to Miss Carol CCC. She's not feeling well either. Let me know how you're doing, Miss Carol, baby. All right. Now, Miss Lisa Day, she knows a girl who is fighting stage 4 cancer. Her name is Bobby Joe. Now, Bobby Joe's mama takes care of her. So, let's send a prayer to her mom and to Bobby Joe. Okay? Now, let's send, also send a prayer to Miss Lisa Day for the loss of her sister. And, sweet babies, please send a prayer to Miss Angela. She lost her fur baby, Layla. And it's just, you know, losing your fur baby is like losing one of your children. You get so attached and, and just please send Miss Angela a prayer. And um, let's send a prayer to Miss Sandy Eubanks' niece. Her boyfriend was shot multiple times. So let's send a prayer that he's okay. Let me know, Miss Sandy. I sent you a message and I don't know what it's. It's not going through, so let me know. All right, let's do these shout-outs, babies. Crafting with Candace, Danny McVisions, Cosmic Carol Creations. That's who CCC is. That's on the prayer list. Cosmic Carol Creations, Wilfoot Resin and Wood Creations, India Brady Art, Claire's Crafty Corner, Art by Me by Andrew Walker, Creative Mind Creations, Laney's Crafting Creations, Nap Time Creations, Lisa's Fluid Art, Live Sleep Resin, A Craftman's Imagination, Tanya Beecher Wood Turning, Sharon Lindley, Vivid Days Art. And remember, our collaboration is November 12th. It's getting close, babies. Uh, Resin Robert, Zynet Craft Ideas, uh, Irish Girl Dutch Pour, and a special shout out to my sweet baby Christopher. I seen your Halloween outfit. Christopher, and I loved it, baby. I loved it. Just a, oh, you scared me, old vampire teeth. Hoo -hoo. I love you, Christopher, and I hope you enjoyed your Halloween, baby. All right, now I want to say, um, when I was doing my painting, I, I, every morning I would get up and, and get my prayer list, and I would pray, and um. Every night before I'd go to bed. So I, I continued the prayers, babies. Yes, I did. And uh, I love y'all. And I just wanted to show y'all that I did do it. I did. But crazy me forgot to turn the microphone on because I'm not used to this. You know, I'm used to my camera speaker. So, yeah, I was just talking, honey. My mouth was moving 100 miles an hour. So, I'm going to town today, and I'm going to get a Christmas tablecloth. I thought I had one somewhere, but I can't find it. Get a Christmas Let me raise y'all up so I can look at you. Now, I look like uh, too fine. I don't know what to do. Because I just got up. Well, I woke up at 2.30 this morning, and I came in here, and I was looking at this, and, and um. I was like, I've got to do something. So I'm just going to pop on a quick video and show them how I did it. And about this amazing, I cannot believe it, shoe polish, stains wood. Stains wood. Oh, yeah. And I put ribbon around the, um, 
breast cancer awareness tray. Yes, I did. I did that too. Now I want to show y'all what it looks like. Look at the ribbon. Oh my God. Look, I went through the top hole and the bottom and tied a bow. Now you can hang it on the wall. Ain't that gorgeous? I love this tray. I love it. It's so pretty to me. So yeah, got that. Now, um, got that done. And my next project, I believe I'm going to go over here and get all of my Christmas molds out. And I've put me a little table right here on the side. And I'm just going to put them on this table and go one by one, my Christmas. But I'm going to have to, um, i got to do my collab. i got to make that video. So, got to do that. So, uh, it may be like two or three, four days. Maybe not that long. Maybe not. Probably not that long. I'm just, you know, saying it might be. And work on my collab with Miss Sharon Lindley. Yes, honey. I'm excited about it, but I'm nervous too. I'm kind of nervous. But anyway, babies, I'm going to let y'all go. I'm going to quit running my mouth. But I, I had to get on here because the prayers didn't go like it. The video wasn't saying nothing. I was like, yeah. Nothing. I couldn't believe it. So, that being said, I love y'all. And y'all have a blessed day. And I will see y'all on my next video, babies. Peace, love, prayers, and happiness. Bye. I can get it to go. Here we go.